well now just 18 years of age last month the Chinese champion for the last couple of years so we watch him closely first time I think we've both seen him Let's see how he goes Jin Boyang is getting to Tango Amore Has an outrageous start scheduled. Quadlets, triple toe. And he's done it. And he made it look easy. And look at the tariff for it. Triple Axel next, if he lands it, he's a contender. Just. step sequence Precocious talent has another quad scheduled here, the quad toe loop. And he's landed that as well. This is just amazing. Just occasionally in all sports, something comes your way and hits you straight between the eyes when you weren't expecting it. Never seen it before. His reputation came before him, though, as runner-up in World Juniors. But what a delight. Not just the Chinese here. I'm sure every one of you at home marking the name. Xin Boyan. That opening combination was just amazing huge and there's uh, there's detail in the choreography too the arms yes they could be a little stronger and and he'll that'll develop and the, there is more that you could get to to embrace the quality of the movement that some of the others will get to so probably on the second mark he won't quite get the same level on skating skills transitions things like that but it's good but here is that opening oh. yep Length. And as you say, the choreography was good too. It was. It was. The arms are. The arms are are a, a little wafty at times. That's, that's what I mean by having the the strength in them. But no. yep, working on the spins, getting the changes of position. But I think that opening element on on our screens it came up as 19.6, and I. I had the, the quad looks is down on a base value of 13.6 on, on my sheet. So um, that was added in with the combination factor. Huge amount to score in the first element. 
but he's so much more than just a phenomenal jumper. Yes, and it changes the game, doesn't it? When somebody starts to do this, a short program, I'm putting two quads in here and having one in combination. That becomes the benchmark, man. Well, he's put himself in contention now for a, a place on the podium, that's for sure. There are big guns to come, the biggest of them all. Last season, Javier Fernandez, Chan and... And you will have a, a major say in what happens at World Championships in Boston. But this guy is now, well, you know, you look at him and say top ten in the world. And podium place here, if he can do roughly the same tomorrow. Big moment in his young life right now. Remember, he's only just 18. 90.05, that's 15 marks better. Huge marks for technical. Not bad for presentation, but it's the technical that's got him there. And he is a runaway leader now of this event.